In this video, I'll explain the loading and conditioning components of the Comfy UI workflow and what it does. Let's get started. The first, unet loader. This component loads a diffusion model with two parameters, unet name and weight D type, which is crucial in the image generation process. It generates the model output, which can be used in both basic scheduler and basic guider component, for this instance. It uses Flux1Dev as the UNET model and employs 8-bit floating point precision for memory efficiency while maintaining computational accuracy. The second, Dual Clip Loader. This component loads the clip model, which is responsible for converting textual input into something the image generation process can use. It generates the clip output, which is passed to clip text encode. For this instance, this component handles the text understanding and image text alignment capabilities by loading two clip models, a T5 model optimized with 8-bit floating point precision for enhanced text understanding, a clip L model for robust image text feature extraction. Together, these provide the dual encoding capability necessary for processing both text and image inputs. The third component, load VAE. This is the variational autoencoder component. For this instance, using AE manages the encoding and decoding of images between pixel space and latent space. It compresses images into a lower dimensional latent representation for the diffusion model to work with, and then decodes the results back into viewable images. The fourth, string literal. This component is where you input the actual text description. This is the description that will later guide the image generation. It generates string, which can be passed to clip text encode component. The fifth component, clip text encode. This component takes the text description you provide and encodes it into a format that the clip model can understand, which will guide the image generation process. It takes two inputs, clip from dual clip loader, text from string literal. It generates conditioning, which can be sent to the basic guider component to assist in guiding the image creation process. The sixth component, basic guider. This component creates a guide signal based on the clip encoded text description. This guide helps steer the image generation process so that the final result aligns with your textual description. It takes in model from unit loader, conditioning from clip text encode. It generates guider, which can be passed to sampler custom advanced component. That's all. See you in the next video.